News First starts now. First at six, damning and disturbing new details. This fired Doraville police officer, Miles Bryant, now accused of dumping a 16 year old girl's naked body in the woods. Susanna Morales mysteriously disappeared almost seven months ago. The teenager's remains just discovered in Gwinnett County last week. And tonight, the 22 year old who was sworn to protect is in custody, charged with concealing her death. Good evening, I'm Sean Gables. And I'm Rick Fulbaum and Bryant, the former officer, made his first appearance in court today. Atlanta News First reporter Zach Summers got his hands on the arrest warrant and he joins us live from Norcross, the last place that Susanna was seen alive. And Zach, these warrants offer some pretty grim details about what might have happened. Yeah, these, that's exactly right. These documents give us a clue into what investigators believe may have happened to Susanna Morales, but we don't yet know the full story. She was walking in this exact area when she disappeared, the 16 year old and Miles Bryant. Turns out he lived right here in these apartment complex. You're only going to want to talk to your lawyer about the facts of your case. The now former Doraville police officer charged in connection with the death of 16 year old Susanna Morales appeared in court for the first time Tuesday. Your bond was denied by the judge that signed the warrant. Now, the reason given was that you are a danger to the community. According to the warrant application, Miles Bryant is suspected of rape and murder, then dumping Morales' naked body in the woods. Right now, the 22-year-old has only been charged with concealing the teen's death and giving a false report the day after she disappeared, telling officers that someone broke into his vehicle and stole his gun. Just saying that he's a police officer, he maybe like uses a... Uh no, officer of power to maybe lure her in or something. Morales' family learned of Bryant's arrest the same day they laid her to rest. The Meadowbrook High School student was last seen walking home on July 26th. I just kept thinking about my daughter, like, that's it. That's all I could think about was my daughter, like, this could be my child. A neighbor who didn't want to be identified shared this video of investigators collecting items, including a sheet from Bryant's vehicle. She says Bryant moved into their complex last summer. He told her he was a police officer and security for the property. Smiling, laughing, just living his life. And it's a whole poor baby that's laid out in a field somewhere. Like, what? Are you serious? Like, how can you be that cold hearted? How is somebody that cold hearted? You never know like who's out here. Now, state records show Bryant started his law enforcement career in 2020 as a jailer with the Forsyth County Sheriff's Office. He'd been with the Doraville Police Department since September of 2021. Morales' family tell us they don't know how the two may have known each other, if at all. We're live in Gwinnett County. Zach Summers, Atlanta News First. All right, Zach, thank you very much.